everyone. Welcome to Crafts Around the House. My name is Rita Grimes and we will be doing Christmas topiaries today. For Christmas topiaries, we will need ornaments. Ornaments of your choosing, the size. I usually go with the big, the medium, and the small, but today I decided to switch it up a little bit, make it a little bit fun, and go with the same size, but character ones and some other ornaments to put in between and some to decide which ones to go on the top to top it off and of course you need a base you can use a vase um, if you're doing it outside or an urn but today we're going to do an inside one so we're using a regular Christmas box with styrofoam on the inside to hold it in Okay, all right. So now the first thing we have to do after I hot glue my styrofoam inside, then I close my box because I need to make a hole and a circle for my um, stick to go through. And you see, I'm just making kind of like an X just enough to get my stick in. All you have to do is push it down in there, styrofoam, and close it up. Now you have your base nice and sturdy. Okay, we're gonna move this aside for right now. And now we're gonna start on our ornament. I'm gonna start, I'm gonna put, you have to decide if you want which one is the bottom ornament? I have decided that the reindeer will be, will start us off. We're gonna take the first, make the top part off. Sometimes you can just pull them off, but these are not like that. So I have to pop it off a little. Now, it should just come right on off. And that's the top part with the hanger. We don't need that. Put that aside. Some of them are not that tough, but the, these are glued on for the novelty ones. Then to get this off, I just take my wire cutters and clip around the plastic. It makes it so easy when you do that. You can smooth it down, mine's pretty smooth, so I'm just leave it there. If not, you can just take your wire cutters and smooth it out. Get those small little pieces off. Throw that away, because we don't need it. And is nice and smooth. Now, for the bottom, we need, we have to put a hole in there. Make sure that the bottom is at the very bottom. At most of them, most ornaments will have a little line, a faint, faint line that you can see, and then you'll know you're right in the middle. But these do not. And you just take your hot glue gun, and put the tip right there. And you see how it's melting in the end? And then you pull it back out. Now, I just take my scissors and I stick it in there and I just go around. Make sure they shatterproof ornaments, not glass ornaments. You can't do these with those. You can only do this with the shatterproof. Let's see if our stick fits. Woohoo! Very nice. Okay, so that is our first one, and then we just keep building upon that. We do the same thing with the smaller ornaments. I have three small ones to choose from. 
and we do the same thing with those. And then next, this is the snowman. Hey, Mr. Snowman. And y'all have noticed that I left the top on the snowman's head. You'll see why in just a moment because that makes it so much easier for the top. Now, because it doesn't go all the way through, for the snowman, I may have to glue the snowman. Or I made the hole, you know, just a little bit big. So I'll just glue. I'll put some glue right around the hole right in the hole and that's the way you do if you have to do it or put tape or something to make it nice and tight and hold it right there and of course we can't have the snowman without a snowman hat so I made a little do-it-yourself snowman hat to put on Frosty's head that's why I left the top Okay, so here is our nice Christmas topiary that you can use to put in the house. And if you um, want to, you can put it outside. But of course, you can't let the box get wet. And um, if you like this craft and any others, you can always visit us at www.cumberlandcountync.gov backslash library or call us at 910 483-7727. Have a great day.